and welcome back to Fallout 4. But more importantly, welcome back to Diamond City, the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. I genuinely have no idea why it's called Diamond City. Because, mm. you know, diamonds aren't green. But anyway, what we're going to be doing this episode is we're going to be going over here. And we are going to be going off to talk to Detective Monsieur Valentin. I'm also going to sort out my quests so that I'm following the right quest. There we go. Uh, and we're going to find out if he knows anything about our son. And if he does, well, then we can find out some stuff from him. Ellie? <sighs> are you here? Nick? There he is. Oh, God. It's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> You keep laughing at death. Someday, death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Thank you. Now pay me. My reward. They always gotta ruin the moment with money talk. Here. I know an amount wasn't on the table when you went out to find him, but mm -hmm. you deserve a reward. Thank Plus you. a little something extra. <sighs> no. If you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. <laughs> our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Right. So uh, where, where can I? Ah, oh, right here. Ha ha. It's just my seat. Trying to find someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. Okay then. Uh, describe one eleven. We in a vault when it happened. Uh, vault one eleven. It was some kind of cryo facility. You were on ice, huh? More importantly, you were underground, sealed up. A lot of obstacles to get through just to take one person. What else can you tell me? We're looking for my baby, Sean. He's less than a year old. Why would anyone take him? Good question. Why your family in particular? Why an infant? Someone would be taking on all of his care, and a baby needs a lot of it. Anything else you remember? There was a man and a woman, and they didn't say much, but but I remember they they called me the backup. So we're talking a small team, professionals, the kind that know to keep their lips tight when on the job. Not sure what the backup means, though. Well, that confirms it. This isn't a random kidnapping. Whoever took your kid had an agenda. Hmm. There's a lot of groups in the Commonwealth that take people. Raiders, super mutants, the gunners. And, of course, there's the Institute. Hmm, which one should I... Uh... The institute. So you think this institute is responsible? Well, they're the boogeymen of the Commonwealth. If something goes wrong, everyone blames them. Easy to see why. Those early model synths of theirs stripped whole towns for parts, killing everything in their way. Then you got the newer models, good as human, that infiltrate cities and pull strings from the shadows. Worst of all, no one knows why they do it, what their plan is, or where they are. Not even me. I'm a synth myself. A discarded prototype, anyway. Hmm. <laughs> Don't lie to me, Nick. You're one of them. They made you. Yeah, I've heard it all before. You're a freak. You've got something to hide. Blah, blah, blah. But the truth is, people smart enough to build something like me are smart enough to cover their tracks. And arrogant enough to throw their unwanted trash into the Commonwealth fend for itself. Okay. Hmm. You don't know anything about them. Really? Some kind of security setting strips or blocks out those memories. And it's not just me. Any synth that gets trashed, left behind, or escapes the Institute has the same problem. Probably some kind of failsafe. Okay, then. Either way, I need to find Sean. You're right. The speculation is getting us off track. Let's focus on what you saw. What did these kidnappers look like? 
Uh, bald. Came right up to me. Bald head, scar across his left eye. Wait, it couldn't be. You didn't hear the name Kellogg at all, did you? No. They never said their names. Hmm. Way too big of a coincidence. Ellie, what notes do we have about the Kellogg case? The description matches. Bald head, scar, reputation for dangerous mercenary work, but no one knows who his employer is. And he bought a mm. house here in town, right? And he had a kid with him, didn't he? Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned wet stands. The boy with him was around 10 years old. It's Sean. It's Sean. It has to be... somehow. Don't jump the gun on me. You said you were looking for an infant, remember? That's over nine years difference by my count. Look, maybe he has a son of his own. Nah. Or someone else's kid. Either mm. way, they both vanished a while back. Let's okay. Let's take a walk over to Kellogg's last known address. Wait, what the fuck happened to his desk? Out where he went. <laughs> what happened to the furniture? Go to that part of town, but you two should still be careful. I always am. Sweet. Okay, so we have some leads. Let's uh. Let's go to that part of town then, Nicky boy. Lead the way, Nicky boy. Ugh, fine, Jesus Christ, I'll go the other way. Uh-huh. I don't know why he has two doors to leave. It's, it's a bit weird, if you think about it. Right! So. The west stands are over here, I seem to remember. Yes, they are. Right. I wonder why it was abandoned. Hmm, who knows? Not me, anyway. Can we unlock it? No, because it's a master lock. Where the fuck did you come from? <laughs> it's fucking appeared. Anyway, where's... Where's our... Where's our boy? Um... Nick! Where did you go? Nick! I'm gonna get a little worried now. Nick! Why are you just standing there? I don't know why we let Hey Valentine. Hold your horses. Well, then go. I'm I'm here, so go. Just go. Why? Why aren't you? Was I supposed to go through that one very specific door? Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> what the fuck was that? So thirsty. Doctor says I can't drink. It's one heck of a lock. Something to hide, oh, wow. Kellogg. Why don't you give it a try? What? What? We're not even there. What is? What is going on? You're just confusing me, Nick. I think you're confusing yourself as well. Get that door to open. Can you walk a little faster, maybe? Just a little bit faster? Oh, fuck it, fine. I'll try and open it. Come on, let's try and open this door. Oh, wow, I can't. Why is he taking so long? You're a robot! Move faster! Come on! Come on! Jesus! Move. Faster. Faster. Move. Move. Faster. Faster. Move. Move. Just walk faster for fuck's sake. Right. Nick. I can't get through that door. No. See that platform in the distance? Near the city yep. entrance? Uh huh. The elevator to the mayor's office. Why don't you go ask around there? I'll stay Kick. here and see if I can jimmy this lock. Okay then, I'll go ahead and do that. I also just realized I don't have a lot of HP, so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh. Just uh. Just help myself get a little better. Right. Ugh. Right. 
Uh, Fire Piper, sorry. Not sorry, really, though. Right. Oh, you're taking a while, aren't you? There we go. And we stop, and we move inwards. And boom, boom. The mayor's receiving visitors as long as they aren't members of the press. Did you need help? Yes. Kellogg's house. I need to talk to someone about Kellogg's old house in the West Stands. Mr. Kellogg's residence? He left town a while ago. We foreclosed on the property and locked it up. If there was something belonging to the man that you have a claim on, you could ask the mayor to hear you out. No guarantees. I don't have time. I need that key now. Why is finding this key so important to you, honey? Oh, I'm not taking a sass for you. Please. All I want to do is find my baby. The man who owned that house kidnapped him. You do seem like a sweetheart. <gasps> All right. I'm it works! Leave this key on my desk and forget I put it there. Your baby's lucky he has a mother like you. I hope you find him. Okay then, I'm just gonna take 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 the thing, <laughs> even though she just kind of accepted a bribe with a fucking guard over there. Okay, let's go, Piper. <laughs> oh wait, Piper's not here. She's still down there. No wait, where the fuck did Piper go? Wait, what? Where's Piper gone? What? Hmm, suspicions are arising. Uh, that was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be, though. So, uh, that's good. Right, so down here. Oh, we have to go all the way back around. Come on. How are you? Ba boom. Ba boom. And here we go. I don't understand why Valentine smokes, since, you know, he doesn't have any lungs, nor can he feel the effect of doing so. Hmm. All right. Anyway, what can we find in here, which I can Around. steal? Kellogg must have left something behind. Yep, you sure did. Anything in that? No? Okay, I'm... Again, I'm just gonna take everything, if you don't mind. A guy like Kellogg would think big. Um, right, so. Uh, nothing there. Upstairs. A few little things. Check out that desk. A, few, a few more things. Right, and then under the desk, we have this little button. Well, one way to hide a room. Sure is. Damn, this is a lot of good stuff in here. <gasps> so much stuff. All of a Merc's favorite thing. Valentine, please get out of the way so I don't have to pickpocket you. Okay, fine. I won't take any of that stuff over there, which is really useful. But oh well. Wait, what the f. What the fuck? Just a little. Jesus. That's weird, half. Nick, why don't you search that table? Then we'll compare notes. Okay, sure, but I kind of want to take the stuff. Okay, thank you for moving. Uh, more stuff in there. Nothing in there. That stuff. Nothing in there. Then we have the cigarettes. Right, cigars. Beard. Forty-four caliber bullets. Cigars. San Francisco sunlights. Mm, interesting brand. Won't lead us anywhere. I can use dog meat. I wonder if dog meat could pick up the scent. Say, that's not a bad idea. Some dogs out there in the Commonwealth can track a man for miles. Why can he? Fetch him and let him have a whiff. See if he picks up the trail. Uh, before you head out, uh, I know this is personal business. Mm -hmm. If you have to face Kellogg on your own, just say so. Besides, you already have plenty of company. We can't all go sniffing through the Commonwealth after one man. Can we not? Um, shall I take Nick with me? 
Or should I leave him here? Take Nick with me. I'll leave him here. I don't know. I might need your help on this one. But maybe I should go on my own. If you need me, just come knocking. If not, then the next time I see you, I hope it's with your son. Safe and sound. Cool, cool. Okay, it's available to be my companion, but I still have Piper, which is good. Anyway, so he's going to leave, and, and I'm going to leave, so he doesn't look suspicious. <coughs> We're definitely not with each other. <clears throat> yeah, sure, sure. Right. And there's dog meat. Sniffy Hi. sniff dog meat. The scent boy. Uh now get, get Kellogg. Boy. Take me to that son of a bitch. Okay then. Go go do it. Thank you. Is Piper with me? Yeah, Piper's with me. Okay, go on, dog meat. Go faster, cause you know. We're on a budget here. Good to be back at Diamonds. Keep going, dog meat. Don't stop. I didn't tell you to. Keep going. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just got really surprised when you just disappeared. <laughs> In the middle of nowhere. And all that shit. Oh, look at that. Mm mm. Look at that. Lovely bit of ketchup. I mean, of course it isn't, but you know, shush. Oof, that does look evil though. Oof. Mm, not nice. Yeah, not nice at all. Mm. Right, go on, dog meat. Keep going. I did, again, didn't tell you to stop. Keep going, boy. Don't you stop for no one. Keep going. Surprised you can still smell the shit, even though it's like you know, really wet. <laughs> I swear dogs can't smell stuff when it's all, you know, wet and rainy. I don't know. Oh, what do you see? What do you see, boy? Somebody was here. You think it was Kellogg? Yes. San Francisco Sunlights. Kellogg's preferred brand, all right. Hmm. What do you think, boy? Enough to go on? We good? You good dog meat? I'll need your nose to track Kellogg, boy. Come on, boy. Let's go find that son of a bitch. Keep going. It's getting a bit dark. Keep going. Don't stop. Ugh. Ah! What do you at? What do you at? What do you at? There's one. Go kill him. Kill the son of a bitch. Fucking hell. Evil little bastard. Jesus Christ, I hate those things. Where's... Oh, where's... There it is. Radiated blood. Nuclear material. I don't need any anything else than that, because the rest of it is just disgusting. Right, uh, where are you going, dog meat? Come back here. Well, don't come back here, but you know what I mean. 
Right. Where are we off to, dog meat? Oh. Ooh, going down here. What is it? What is it, dog meat? It's a dead guy! Inspect the blood. Inspect the blood. Bloody bandages. Dog meat can track this. Inspected the blood quite a bit. Can I take his stuff? To go on? Where's he at? Where do you go? We'll take the drifter outfit. Kellogg's still out there. Where's he going? Track him, boy. Where are you going? Are you going back up there, to, but just back the way we came? Okay, cool, fine. What's your angle, boy? What's your angle? Ooh, mushrooms. Weird. Keep going. Come on. Let's go. Kill that thing. Whatever that thing is. That's Yogi Bear. No. And ghouls? No, I did not agree to any of that. Oh, they're all going over there. Okay, I'll take your stuff. I can't believe Yogi Bear would betray me in such a horrible way. And they're all dead. Yay. Oh. Okay, continue going off dog meat. Keep going. Can't be too far now. Keep going, dog meat. This place looks sketchy. But he's going in there. What is it, boy? What is it you see? Oh, what's up there? We gotta stick together, pal. At least until we find Kellogg. What is it? Where? Where? Oh, shit. I've been detected. The shit! Huh? Clever. Yeah, sure, sure, sure was clever. Def oh, definitely didn't fall for it. <laughs> stuff come on boy let's keep going because I almost killed myself just gonna quick save so we don't lose any more stuff if I actually do die oh, how far is this place that we gotta get to god damn keep going dog meat keep going didn't didn't tell you to stop Keep going. There we go. I hear the other one. There's the other one. And the other one's dead. Oh, what's going on over there? Yes, dog me. Die. Thank you. The fuck? Acrobats? What? Okay then, that's really weird, but I'll take it. What? No, run away from the car before it explodes. There we go. Oh, where are the other ones? 
I can hear some more growling, as it were, in the in the background. Yes. Okay, keep going, dog meat. We're not there yet. Come on, boy. Come on, it can't be too far now. And if it is, oof. Oh god. What have we here? System corrupt. I can't feel my legs. <laughs> it, it's funny. But we have another one of these. Another one of his stogies. Come on, boy. <laughs> Keep going, boy. We ain't there yet. Okay, he's on the, he's, he's on the trail. He, he stopped. Okay, he's still going. Keep going, come on. Ooh, taking a detour. We're going off road. Where are you taking us, dog meat? Oh, I got stuck. Come on, dog meat. Stop stopping. Just keep going. Bloody rags. What do you think, boy? Huh? Is this our man? I would say so. Here we go. Almost there. Ooh, this place looks creepy. <laughs> this place looks very creepy. Ah, the fly's back. Can't fucking hit it. Come on, there we go. Why did that take so long? I don't know. Who knows? They probably do. There we go. Let's get rid of them. Ugh. Right, come on, dog meat. Boy. Huh? Is he in here, boy? This is it, isn't it? We are both here. All right, Blue. It's you and me. I think Dogmeat's earned some time off. Okay, then, Dogmeat. Hey, boy. Everything okay, boy? Uh. Don't never mind. Dogmeat. Just saying hello. Okay, so he's gonna fuck off back to Sanctuary, I'm gonna guess. But you're gonna stay, and then next episode, we're gonna fight whatever shit is gonna be in here. <sighs> oh, that was quite a boring episode. I, I realize, I realize that that was quite boring for a lot of people, but oh well, I am sorry. Uh, but we have to get through some of the boring bits of this game in order to get to the fun bits, which we will see in this next episode when we try and fight Kellogg. <laughs> Which I feel utterly underprepared for. So maybe I'll do some preparation off screen. Uh, do a tiny bit of leveling up. And maybe uh, maybe get some... Maybe do some weaponry stuff. But yes. Until... Oh, I got a level up actually. Come on. But boom Right. Mm, gun that. Yes. That's what I wanted. Right. So yes. Next episode, we'll go and see what's in Fort Hagen. And we'll try and fight Kellogg. And until then, 
That's a goodbye from Fallout 4. It's a goodbye.